hi robins welcome back to my channel i hope all is well i am so excited it is the holidays and i get to decorate my apartment for the christmas season i also want to welcome the newcomers to my channel and to the robin community i hope you're having fun watching old videos and getting ready for the new ones so there are many types of christmas trees that are available for purchase in Second Life. There are pre-decorated trees and bare ones that you can add bits of pieces of your own to add a little bit more extra to your holiday space. I personally enjoy them both. This Apple Fall Heritage Christmas tree is one of my favorite trees to use for the Christmas holidays. I love the fullness of the tree and the fact that it is bare, allowing me to add my own ornaments to make it more personalized to my style. Another of my favorites is the Dust Bunny Alpine Christmas tree. This is pre-decorated and is beautiful on its own. However, I am going to modify these two threes together. I removed the pieces of the alpine tree that I enjoy and added it to the heritage tree. I also used my favorite pieces from the Fancy Decor Gilt Tree Decoration Collection, along with the black ribbon from Apple Fall. By the way, these ribbons are free for purchase at the Apple Fall main store. I really wanted to add more of a holiday touch to my mantle. I own the era fireplace from the loft and area. I added the caramel log inserts from Apple Fall to give it more of a festive feel. For my runner, I used the brass candlesticks from Apple Fall, removing the candles and using the green leafy parts. And adding a few of my favorite vase and candles from Fancy Decor and Vespertine. Not forgetting my wooden Christmas tree from Hive and miniature ceramic house from Half Deer. I am going to add a few more pieces from Vespertine around the fireplace to help tie in that Christmas season spirit.
Now, it wouldn't feel like Christmas to me if I didn't add a wreath to my door. I'm first going to add the Christmas Galland Modern Wreath by half there, removing the ornaments and the ribbon. Layering it with the December Eve Mera Collection Wreath from Nutmeg. I was able to hide the frame and the shadow which gave me the desired look I had in mind for my wreath. For my dining table, I added the Christmas gallon by Half Deer, removing the ornaments and the bows and duplicating them. Adding the ceramic Christmas tree, also from Half Deer, along with December Eve vase by Nutmeg. For my place settings, I use the Byron Collection Place Settings by Avani, the Vista Glass by Fancy Decor, along with the wreath from Half Deer, and a very cute touch of an ornament snowflake from Vespertine. I really wanted to add a bit more to my coffee table. I was able to find decorative pieces from Vespertine, Load, Hive, Half There, and Dust Bunny. And let's not forget the treat that we left out for Santa by Andika. And yes, at this house, we do leave Santa. Espresso Martinis by Chic. Chica. Getting my space together for the holiday season has been so much fun. Surfing through different stores, and finding just the right things to match my style. I hope you all have enjoyed watching me get ready for the holiday season and have been inspired to decorate your space as well. All items that I use today will be credited in the description bar below. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for future notifications of my postings. And if you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Also, leave a comment down below letting me know what you have been doing to get ready for the holiday season. And let's connect. Join the Discord and follow me on Instagram and keep up with my day-to-day -day Second Life routines. So until next time, bye!